And our fourth and final main topic today gets submitted to us by Studman Mike, who writes, Hey, John, what do you think about Dwayne Johnson's tweet that possibly hints at a Henry Cavill Superman cameo in Black Adam? There's only two actors in Hollywood right now with enough star power clout to make studios give them what they want. Dwayne Johnson and Tom Cruise. If The Rock wants Henry Cavill in the movie, Henry Cavill will be in the movie. I only hope it's true. Thanks and bring on the filthy. All right. <clears throat> Thanks a lot for saying that in, man. And look, you all know I alluded to it earlier. My deep love for Henry Cavill, Zack Snyder's Man of Steel it is, to me, the single most underrated comic book film of all time. I'm not saying it's the greatest comic book film of all time, but it is easily the most underappreciated, underrated comic book film of all time. The film is brilliant. It is a masterpiece of the genre. I love this film. I love it more and more every time I watch it. I'm obviously a big Henry Cavill fan. His work in The Tudors, I thought was fantastic. Man from Uncle, his work in that, he's fantastic. His Mission Impossible role, Tom Cruise, he's fantastic. I love him in The Witcher, he's incredible in that. I am a totally in a bromance with Henry Cavill. I do not deny it. I do not hide it. Got a big bromance crush on, on Henry Cavill. I just think he's great, and I love his Superman. He's my favorite Superman. And I want to see more of him. Now, there's been a lot of talk going on in the world of DC and everything about what is what are they going to do with Superman? You know, there was a Michael Jordan Superman project. There was a J.J. Abrams Superman project. You know, all signs all point towards Henry Cavill isn't going to get another crack at it. All that kind of stuff. But there's been one thread that's been dangling for a couple of years now, which is this. Dwayne Johnson... <clears throat> has mentioned in the past that he would love to see Black Adam and Henry Cavill's Superman on screen together. He has said that in the past. Also, Henry Cavill's agent is Dwayne The Rock Johnson's agent. Dwayne The Rock Johnson's ex-wife is his manager. Still, is still his manager. And her other prize client is Henry Cavill. So that's always kind of been dangling out there. But there has never been a bigger possible glimmer of hope. Hope, ladies and gentlemen. The S stands for hope. There's never been a bigger possible dangling of hope for those of us in the Henry Cavill Appreciation Army. I'm just making shit up. There's never been a bigger symbol of hope than what Dwayne The Rock Johnson just put on his social media. There was a tweet that went out by a fan that said this. Heroes, I can't wait for this movie, talking about Black Adam. I don't care if there are no cameos in it, but if there are, and then, then he puts in the picture, of course, the Black Adam chest and the Henry Cavill Superman crest. Dwayne Johnson retweeted this. And in retweeting it, he said the following. From back in the day, when I was wrestling in flea markets for 40 bucks a match, all the way to now, I've learned to always listen to the audience because they will always lead you to where you need to go. I hear you, and I always, and, and always, I got you. <clears throat> retweeting. A fan basically putting out a plea into the universe. My God, can we have Henry Cannibal Superman in this thing? Dwayne Johnson retweets it. And by the way, uh, thank you to the Fresh Prince of Asgard who just became a director level member of the channel. Thank you, Fresh Prince. Not only did he retweet this plea of mortal man into the heavens, let's Henry Cavill be in this movie. He retweets it and says, I hear you and I got you. I hear you and I got you. All right. Let's say something very clear first. And that first very clear thing is this. This is not confirmation 
that Henry Cavill is going to be in Black Adam. All right. <clears throat> Let's just be very clear about that. This is not confirmation that Henry Cavill is going to be in Black Adam. I would love it if he was. I would love it if he is. But this is absolutely not even anywhere close to being confirmation that he is. Okay? It is not confirmation that he is. Would I love to see Dwayne The Rock Johnson on screen with Henry Cavill Superman, even if it was just like one scene, one clip, whatever? Sure, I would. I absolutely would. It would be a joygasm, the likes of which I could not put into words. I would absolutely adore it. I would absolutely love it. But despite the fact that Dwayne Johnson is retweeting a clear image of Henry Cavill's Superman crest along his own Black Adam crest, he's retweeting that and saying, going out of his way, to say, I hear you, I'm listening, and I got you. We want to take a second to thank the sponsor of today's video, Manscaped. Now, guys, you know I love Manscaped. You've heard me go on and on about the Lawnmower 4.0 and mm, that body wash. I love it so much. And so we got to ask, guys, have you started your spring cleaning yet? The carpets need cleaning, the drapes need dusting, and your lawn needs mowing, gentlemen. And you guys know Manscaped is more than just one product. They have a whole lineup of products to help you guys feeling, smelling, and looking your best. And so Manscaped is proud to present to you the Performance Package 4.0, which is the only tool that you need to keep your boys looking, smelling, and feeling good this spring. Now, to start off with, you get the Lawnmower 4.0. Guys, we have talked about this. What is wrong with us? Why have we for so long been using these terrible tools that were never meant for cutting our hair down there? The razor clipper things on our electric razors. That's barbaric, guys. You need the Lawnmower 4.0. And then there's the Weed Whacker. You guys have heard our own Ray Aura talk about this thing. He loves using it to get that hair in your nose and the ear hair and then they offer lots of other stuff like the crop preserver it's an anti-chafing ball deodorant and moisturizer the crop reviver it's a spray on toner for your balls and of course they've got the perfect grooming tool for your face with the plow 2.0 the perfect razor for the finest shave on that face so guys get 20 percent off plus free shipping with the code campia that's c-a-m-p-e-a at manscaped.com that's 20 percent off and free shipping with the promo code Campia at manscaped.com. It's time to throw out your old hygiene habits and upgrade your life. It does not mean that Henry Cavill is going to be in this. Because I saw some headlines running around out there saying, confirm, Dwayne The Rock Johnson confirms that Henry Cavill is going to be in Black Adam. As much as I would love to believe that, that ain't the case. This is not Dwayne Johnson confirming this. But you will have to forgive me if I personally believe that Dwayne Johnson gave us enough there, again, not just retweeting the guy, but telling him I'm hearing you and I got you, you would have to forgive me that while I acknowledge this is not confirmation, I believe if you are somebody like me who has been dying to see Henry Cavill as Superman again, there's enough in here to hope about. Like, there's a lot of times when a little piece of news that is obviously completely unrelated to a certain movie project and people go, ooh, maybe this means something. There's nothing to that. But I contend that this right here, this is enough to at least get a little excited about. Understanding this does not mean Henry will be there. It doesn't necessarily mean that. But I believe The Rock tweeting this out this is enough for somebody like me to get excited. I think this justifies saying, I now have a little bit of hope that maybe this could be the case. I understand it doesn't mean it will, but I believe this justifies feeling some hope. So guys, I stand before you today as a man filled with that glorious hope. The hope that only the Kryptonian S can giveth unto man. I am hopeful. I am hopeful. Again, I'm, I'm going to walk into this movie. I'm going to sit in the, my seat in the theater, 
And I'm not going to expect to see Henry Cavill as Superman. But I think it is justified to feel that hope. Anyway, guys, question is for you. What do you think about this? Dwayne Johnson retweeting that out and giving his comments. Do you think that does justify feeling some hope? Maybe you think it means nothing at all. Maybe you think it's a guarantee. I don't know. Whatever you guys think, jump down into the comment section below and leave us your thoughts.